Swisscom is a typical telco, so uh, covering all various uh, offerings from mobile networks, fixed line networks, internet access, but has also a very large IT practice, which might not be known that much, um, from like delivering infrastructures, but also doing SAP integrations as an example, um, covering all these uh, elements as well, IT outsourcing, so uh, becoming more and more um, important IT shop. We focus on our Swiss business, so uh, we have some international activities, but mainly uh, our customers are like all the large enterprises, medium enterprises and the central customers in Switzerland. We have uh, huge market shares in all areas. Um, actually, we can nearly say that every Swiss uh, person or person living in Switzerland is somehow a customer of Swiss. Getting that award from uh, EPG is uh, something which uh, makes us uh, a bit proud and uh, it also shows a bit the like, good relationship we have uh, together with EPG. So it's much more than just someone delivering infrastructure, it's really a, a partner in getting our business uh, digitalized. Uh, yes, but on, on the other side what we do we operate the core banking application, so it's a, uh, within our enterprise division, it's a dedicated uh, large team which uh, operates those infrastructures for the, for the banks. Actually, in some cases, it, it's more Swisscom being than the bank, than the bank itself. Um, and uh, this is already uh, in operation since many years, and yes, there are also APIs, but the part which is now becoming interesting is combining these financial-based services together with other telco services where you can deliver uh, added value, as in the location case I was mentioning before. When you start on, on the digital journey, first is be, be ready for surprises. So be flexible as much as possible. So don't restrict yourself to existing processes. Cut them off where necessary and uh, just take as best practices what uh, the more startup oriented or very successful internet space companies uh, are doing. Uh, copy from there and uh, get yourself uh, ready. If you just stay as an incumbent as we are for like Swisscom in the standard process frameworks which you have from the past, then you cannot master the two-speed IT. So to, to master that, that speedy part of uh, tool speed is uh, the, the most important uh, part from, from my side. The other one is really just like go out there and just do stuff, just get stuff done. Don't talk too much, don't plan too much. And uh, if it does not work, change, be open, discuss with a lot of other um, market uh, uh, um, leaders or, or companies which are in the same space. Don't just look inward into your company. Um, just benefit from, from all the knowledge which is, uh, which is out there. Um, and then I'm sure you're going to take then the, the right approach and the right steps. In the beginning it was really the like um, evaluation of an uh, API platform. So uh, we just made a very standard a way of looking at uh, different companies and in the end we decided for, for EPG uh, was already at that time uh, a, a market leader which is great and then uh, we were lucky as going forward that EPG could not just deliver the platform it's not just the vendor but uh, that we could also get a lot of experiences uh, from EPG in just how to do this di digitalization, how to approach it, sharing the best practices and uh, we, we benefit a lot from, from that input and also this like consulting uh, service uh, Apogee is delivering. Also event like uh, I Love APIs, always a great occasion to just talk to various people within Apogee but also other customers, partners. Um, for me it's also one of the uh, great um, deliverables uh, of, of EPG to bring the industry together and uh, not just pushing forward this is our technology, uh, being much more a companion than just a technology provider. I think that's a key of, of the success of, uh, of EPG. At the moment, yeah, we're typical API based, so <laughs> we use the uh, technology of, of uh, APG in the API space from, from Edge and so on. We use a developer portal to just like give the uh, access to 
to the to the APIs. We use, of course, the API management platform very extensively, and uh, we're not using yet uh, a lot of uh, uh, the other services like like Link, like Insights. Um, but we have all those kind of practices as well in Swisscom, and it might be that in the future have uh, FNG also partner in the in those areas. So with the uh, APIs, it's a it's a technology, but in the end, it's an enabler. It's a business enabler. So that's what I like most. And just talking to a potential business customer, understanding what are the needs or pains, and then saying, "Oh, by the way, I think we have already an API. This is a small piece of software which will help you there, and uh, we can put it uh, available for you in three weeks. Would that sound nice?" And then you see the eyes glowing and custom being, oh wow, incredible, this is possible. So this, this reuse of the existing APIs, that's something which I think is absolutely fascinating.